Topping 12 on Health, a local woman battling mental illness shares her desperate situation. And how she was rescued from homelessness. News 12 Connecticut's 12 on Health reporter Gillian F. is here now to tell us her story. Well, guys, it really opens your eyes to mental illness. If you believe people who don't have a job or people who don't have a home are lazy and looking for a handout, you might think differently after meeting Vanessa Smith. She knows what it's like to be down and outcast. When you're homeless, you feel like you're always so down. I have bipolar, it's a chemical imbalance that I have. All my life I've been homeless. Life is finally looking up for Vanessa Smith. Family centers has opened up the door for me to be able to get my place and live independently. She is now the proud resident of this one bedroom apartment in Stamford that she can enjoy with her son. I love it, it's perfect. <laughs> She even loves her new job at Target. She didn't like being out of work. She was highly motivated to change her situation. In fact, she won this award for excelling in her employment goals. Vanessa is someone that's out there every day at work. Um, she's a contributing member to society, and it really didn't take that much to, to get her going. They pay in half of the, the rent for me. Vanessa qualifies for Family Center's Housing Resource Program because she lives with a prolonged mental illness, and she's trying very hard and with caseworkers to turn her life around. She's such a great example of a positive ending. You know, 30 days ago, Vanessa didn't have a job. She was in a shelter. She didn't have a home. Today, She's working almost every day, and she has a nice place to come home to. In addition to Stamford, Family Centers has offices in Greenwich, Darien, and in New Canaan. For more on their services, go to news12.com and click on numbers and links. She's such an inspiration. Has a great laugh, too. Oh, I know. Her, her <laughs> smile. It's contagious. Thanks, Gilly.